Good evening, everyone. I'm Katie Moore. And I'm Cherise Gibson. Spikes in coronavirus cases among young people have doctors warning about community spreading, which could undo all the progress made so far. Yeah, as Mike McDaniel explains, young people who battle the virus are asking peers to practice personal responsibility and listen to the doctors. It was like terrifying. It was unlike anything else I've ever experienced. 24 year old Cindy Wynn knows what it's like to battle coronavirus. I lost my appetite. Water started tasting really sweet. Um, and then once I started getting shortness of breath, that's when it got really scary for me. This soon to be second year LSU medical student was diagnosed back in mid March. As restrictions loosen across the state, it's people her age who have Dr. Jennifer Avegno, director of the New Orleans Health Department, sending off a warning about community spreading. Recently identified coronavirus clusters at bars in Baton Rouge and graduation parties in New Orleans are part of the problem. Avegno says recent health data shows in Region 1, 50% of new coronavirus cases are in people under the age of 30. 10% are kids under the age of 18. This is a huge shift in what we've been seeing. We have not seen these numbers among young people. Avegno says this shift is happening all over the country and coincides with lifting restrictions. A big concern for Dr. Julio Figueroa with LSU Health. We need to maintain the reduction of transmission so that we can get a hold of this virus. Figueroa says personal responsibility plays a big role. That includes face masks and social distancing as much as possible. It doesn't mean that you can't have fun. Uh, you just got to be mindful of the situations that you're in. Dr. William Lenars with Oshner Health does not expect a large group of critically ill young people because most won't develop significant symptoms. His concern is young people spreading the virus. We're really worried about what happens in two and three weeks when the rest of the population, including the older folks and folks with um, comorbidities, get sick. It's really scary to think that you could transmit it to someone that you love or just even transmit it to a stranger and then that affects someone that they love. Having been through it, Wynn says understanding what the virus can do and what's at stake need to be taken seriously by our peers. Take the time, be considerate. Doctors say regardless of age group, if you recover from coronavirus, that does not automatically make you immune for life. With so many unknowns right now, reinfections are a concern. Mike McDaniel, Eyewitness News. This afternoon, Governor John Bell Edwards tweeted specifically to young people saying take this illness seriously. This age group with the largest numbers of new cases and while you may think you're invincible, you are not. Let's take a look at the latest coronavirus cases in Louisiana. The higher than average trend continues. So listen to this. There were nearly a thousand new cases of COVID in Louisiana. There are also 12 more deaths since yesterday. Hospitalizations are also up by 22, but the number of people on ventilators has not changed since yesterday. And let's look at the rising case numbers. Take a look at the graph on your screen showing the rolling seven day average of new daily cases in Louisiana. And as you can see, the biggest numbers were in April. Then we went down as we went into May and early June. But as more places opened up in phase two, you can see the cases started to rise again with this week having some of the highest numbers in a while. LSU students who are partially blamed for the recent surge in coronavirus cases are getting tested today for free. Fred's in Tigerland hosted the testing event earlier today. Health officials discovered a cluster of cases linked to people packing Tigerland bars recently. The testing is only for college students with ID with more than 100 new cases connected to Tigerland. Officials are urging anyone who visited those bars to self quarantine until they can get tested.